hi good people welcome and welcome back to my channel i want to start this video here and it was about 5 a.m in the morning i will be hosting my family today my mom will be paying a visit together with my sisters so i want to make some food like i want to prepare some meals with you then we see how the day will go by so stick around and watch this video to the end and let's get started I started by washing the meat because I am this one person who will always wash meat from the butcher. I then added some salt to taste and in today's meat I decided to boil it with the spices that I do use. I used some curry powder, some paprika, some roiko, some roiko cube and some beef masala. I also had some peanuts to prepare and for me I normally prepare them in the microwave so I had sorted them the previous night. I just washed them, added some salt and let them rest for like an hour before I prepared them. Please ignore the many things on the countertops. Uh, we normally wash the utensils at night but arrange them in the morning. So this day I woke up earlier and of course I couldn't do anything but I focused on cooking alone. I then started kneading my chapati dough and for me I do use hot water like hot 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 water and some salt alone. So I placed the flour on the basin, added some cooking oil and then I added some hot water mixed with salt, rubbed it to my perfection and kneaded it until I got what I was to achieve. Once I was done, I covered it with a clean film then went straight into peeling off my potatoes and preparing some onions, some tomatoes, some all the natural spices that I was actually to use. After like 20 or so minutes, I then started dividing my dough into small balls before I cooked it. I do prefer cooking them fast without oil. I think in layman's language, you do say kuzichoma kwanza. Then for the second round, it's when I apply oil. Let's take it slow. Where you go, I go too. And if you hit the bottom, I'm going down with you. Let's take it slow. Who cares where we gotta be? You know you'll have a good time wherever you're with me. Let's take it slow. Once I was done making them this way, I covered them with a foil because I had to stop first, go prepare my elder son to school because today he was on a Monday and he had to go to school. 
after 40 or so minutes it's when i came back and started cooking let's take it slow who cares where we gotta be you know you'll have a good time wherever you are let's take it By the way, I had forgotten to let you know that I do use co tilly cooking fat on my chapatis alone. Uh, I once tried this cowboy, but uh, to lipitana nayo, so I went back to tilly, and so far, so good. On the other end, I was making my baby's food. Actually, I was boiling some butternut, and on the other side, I was melting my cooking fat. Finally, 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 guys, I was done and the chapatis turned out so well. So I covered them with a foil, then placed them in the fireless. Many, many, many minutes later, I cooked my peanuts. I actually placed them in the microwave, set them at six minutes. Uh, once they were done, I again placed them in the microwave for another four minutes and they came out so, so, so well. So dry and they were just delicious. I actually forgot to to show you the outcome but they came out so well as the peanuts were cooking i started preparing my stew and i actually used the spring onions the red onions until i cooked them until they were golden brown but i had to multitask guys because i was running out of out of time so on the other sufuria i was cooking some onions too and i was actually intending to cook the potatoes as you can see i was actually multitasking so just stick around and watch how everything went about i hate all this overthinking oh 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 um. Once I was done preparing the stew, I had to transfer it to the 6 kg gas cylinder so that it could continue cooking from there. 
and I placed the other cooking pot on the cooker so that I could cook the cabbage. I couldn't place all the I like I couldn't use all the cooker because the sulfurias were quite big and they couldn't fit. So that's why I had to transfer this to on the other end. As the food was cooking, I came to this second bedroom and at this point my elder son had left for school. So I just dusted everywhere and changed the sheets. Then dusted, like I swept the floor because there was a lot of dirt. Uh, my niece was going to clean it for me because I was actually running out of time. This was the final turnout of the look and I was so impressed. About the duvets on top, uh, I have sold majority of them and I was supposed to deliver them to the recipients. On to the next thing, I came into this second bathroom and I was not actually cleaning but I was replacing the dirty mats to clean ones. Then I also placed some toilet bowls because I wanted the toilet to remain as fresh as possible. I also did the same to the master bedroom and I replaced everything that needed to be replaced. I 
I got this beautiful toothbrush holder from an XUK shop. Why are you hiding? Tell me what must I do? I also removed that cut thing over there. Uh, I had been looking for my gloves for quite some time and I couldn't get them. So that's what exactly what I did. I also replaced our towels to clean one. So this one over here was mine and the one behind the door was for hubby. On to the next thing, uh, I had some laundry to tackle and sorry about the poor lighting. There was too much reflection from the sunlight. So I just, I actually did three loads, but I couldn't show you all of them. Many hours later, I came to the kitchen back and I had needed these mandazi dough, so I just wanted to cook them and we call it a day. I actually did the kneading of camera. Take it slow, where you go, I go to And if you hit the bottom, I'm going down with you Let's take it slow, who cares where we gotta be You know you'll have a good time wherever you're with me Let's take it Once I was done with cooking, I let the mandazis to cool for some time before covering them with the foil. The reason for allowing them to cool is to avoid too much sweating. Mm -hmm. 
that was the food presentation and my guests really enjoyed so thank you so much if you watched up to this minute don't forget to like comment and share until next time see you bye Let's take it slow.